Adaptive Cruise Control Limitations ACC will not detect sudden entry of other road vehicle into host vehicle's lane, driver should take control of the vehicle. ACC will not detect sudden vicinity of stationary object in host vehicle's lane, driver should take control of the vehicle. When the preceding vehicle that has been followed is cutting out, system detects the preceding vehicle as a new target. When vehicle stops, host vehicle will also stop. When vehicle B starts, host vehicle may start without considering the new stationary vehicle because of an irregular radar reflection. At this time, since there is no collision with vehicle, the driver may misunderstand that it is under normal control of vehicle, in this case driver should take control of the vehicle. In the curve entry or exit situation, vehicle in adjacent lane can be selected as the control target and the preceding vehicle in the host lane may be missed, driver should take control of the vehicle. If the radius of curvature is very small, an inadequate or excessive acceleration or deceleration may occur, due to the limitation, driver should take control of the vehicle. In case of poor visibility, driver must take the control of vehicle. In a road intersection, target preceding vehicle may be lost, and ACC may not function as intended. Driver must take the control of vehicle. When the road gradient changes, preceding target vehicle may be lost, and ACC may not function as intended. Driver must take the control of vehicle. Any blockage to sensors, detection will degrade, and ACC features may not function as intended. If the height of the preceding target vehicle is very high, the sensor may not detect it, and ACC functionality may vary. Driver should take control of vehicle. ACC may not recognize pedestrians, driver should take control of the vehicle. ACC might not slow down your vehicle sufficiently, if target starts to decelerate too fast as, ACC only has, 30% of total brake force available in vehicle. If the front radar is exposed to the surrounding road structures, that may affect the detection performance, the front preceding vehicle may not be detected normally, driver should take control of the vehicle. If radar misaligned vertically or horizontally, ACC may produce frequent false deceleration or no deceleration for front preceding vehicle. Visit nearest service center for radar alignment. ACC does not slow down the vehicle for speed breakers, driver should take control of the vehicle. ACC does not slow down the vehicle for potholes, driver should take control of the vehicle. ACC may not slow down sufficiently for road curves, driver should take control of the vehicle. ACC does not slow down for barriers or blockades, driver should take control of the vehicle. ACC does not slow down for oncoming vehicles, driver should take control of the vehicle. ACC does not slow down for crossing or merging vehicles at angles more than 30 degree, driver should take control of the vehicle. ACC does not sufficiently slow down for animals, driver should take control of the vehicle.
ACC may not reliably follow or stop a bicycle, driver should take control of the vehicle. If a very slow moving target cutting in between your vehicle and stationary target then there is a chance that ACC system does not pick up the slow moving target since ACC is not able to discriminate between slow moving target and stationary target. ACC might not detect a target vehicle and slow down when driving along a sharp curve, driver should take control of the vehicle. ACC may not completely slow down for stationary vehicle, while following a two-wheeler, driver should take control of the vehicle. Do not use ACC with an offset to the target vehicle. Do not use ACC to follow motorbikes, where there is no space for your vehicle to navigate. Do not use ACC while there are two wheelers overtaking your vehicle while in stop and go mode. 